Hey everyone, this is Andy from Giz China, and today MLays rolled out their OTA update for the MLays M52, and that brings the phone up to Android 5.0 Lollipop. Now, yesterday MLays released a manual update, and we found that there were a few bugs with that. There was an issue with the memory, and there were a few issues with incompatibility with applications and things. And we hope that maybe the OTA today, which released a few days later um, than it should have done, would solve those issues, but it seems that it's basically the same ROM. So, although we do now have Lollipop 5.0 on our MLAs M52s, it's not a you know it's not it's not a build that we could uh, say it's stable. There are a lot of issues with it, and you know MLAs need to sort a few things out. But Lollipop is here, so let's first of all let's take a look at Lollipop in action. So as you can see, it's it's running on the phone. It, this is the OTA update version of it. If you haven't already updated, I would say you might want to wait. Um, you know, just look at the MLA's Facebook page and check out those uh, issues that people are reporting on there. If you feel you can live with them, give it a go. If you don't think you can, stick with KitKat for now. But if you do want to update, uh, head into settings on your KitKat running phone, go down to About the Phone, Wireless Update, and an update should be there. Uh, you just click updates and it will uh, tell you whether your system is up to date or not. Like I say though, if you are already, already on KitKat, you might want to stick with that for a little bit while, while longer until uh, another Lollipop update comes along. Okay, anyway, so let's, what we've got here, we've got our normal Android 5.0 interface. We've got these always really lovely animations and it feels pretty smooth. Um, you know, people have been complaining that the UI is uh, laggy, but you know, to be honest, it feels okay to me. It doesn't feel that bad at all. It feels quite snappy, flicking from page to page, opening applications up, um, going into the the uh, notifications area. You know, opening websites as well seems to be okay too. If I go to Giz China, so that's the Yahoo search. Go to GizChina.com. Okay, now it's running slowly, but yet before when I tried it, oh, there we go, it's not so bad, it's pretty good. Loading up the pages pretty quickly. So, you know, uh, you know, some people are finding the UI is pretty slow. I, to be honest, it feels okay to me, it's not that bad at all. Um, one issue that I have found, uh, well, a few of the issues I found, one of them is YouTube. Uh, although you can install the YouTube application on your phone from the Google Play Store, it won't play video. So for example, I, I just uploaded a Yumi Hammer Smash video. If I want to play it, it just force closes. So we can't run that. Um, Google Play Store does work. You can install applications directly from there. Just log in and download stuff. Um, another issue is your email it is not syncing. So it's just sitting like this, you know, just saying, getting your message, getting your message, but it's not actually getting the messages. So there are bugs with this. Um, I've heard also that there's issues with the audio quality, but I've not checked that, and also the camera quality too. So uh, overall, although everyone was really excited and you know very eager to get Lollipop on their M52s, um, now that it's here, it might be better, you know, not to use it. You know, just wait, wait a second until MLAs are able to release a more stable version of the ROM. I have run Antutu on here. I'm getting an unverified score of 45,384. Um, we should really be seeing a little bit better than that, being a 64-bit processor with Lollipop. So, you know, maybe there is optimization issues as well as those bugs that need fixing too. If you're really itching to get Lollipop on your Emlays M52, download it, but, you know, you're going to be facing some pretty major bugs uh, that you might not be able to live with day to day. Um, we're going to contact MLAs and find out when another update will be expected and hopefully that will solve these issues. So that's it, that's, uh, that's the uh, Android 5.0 on the M52 by us here at Giz China. Alright, thanks all for your time and I'll see you all soon. Goodbye.